Hey guys, it's your girl Confident Plans back for another video. Today I'm here for the final weekly check-in for the month of September and since this week goes into the first week of October, I'll be setting up my October kit. So very excited to be um, sharing that with you all. So I hope you all are doing well. I am all right so as usual my stickers here <clears throat> excuse me are from magical planner um on etsy i paid for the file and then my best friend from just be designs she went ahead and cut these for me on her silhouette so thanks again bestie and happy birthday it's my bestie's birthday so um i'm gonna go ahead and set these up of course i'll be doing more of this salmon color for debit yellow for no sorry the salmon color is for credit expenses that i have the blue is for cash and then the yellow is for any debit purchases i have which is the bulk of what i use um so let's go ahead and get set up here and um, I'll turn this way, and I think you'll still be able to see if I turn a little bit. So my first expense will be on the 27th. And I'm just getting my stickers off here. Um, I really hope to next year um, invest in um, a silhouette or something so that I can cut my own stickers. Um, so I'm really looking forward to doing that this year. I mean, this year coming up. Um, so, and I like to zoom you in so you can see. And so the first charge will be Amazon. And of course, this planner I'm using is a Erin Condren Planner the 7 by 9 It's the monthly deluxe planner. And it was $36. And this was for uh, my boss's birthday um, at work. And so I got her uh, some gifts. And so I went ahead and made that purchase um, last week for that. Um, also, let's see. The next one will be on the 28th. And that will also be a debit expense. And that will be for Target. And that was for $39.42. And this was for my hair color. Um, I have dreads and I dye my hair red. And so that was for my hair color. I'm hoping to get my hair appointment this week. The next one. is on the 29th here and this charge was for Amazon and 1087 was a gift for a friend um, I used this woman's prayer journal and my friend wanted one um, so I sent it to her I bought it for her. so that was a gift um, nothing on the 30th so I will go ahead and lay down my um, no spin sticker because I'm then going to flip to October and set that up. So let me zoom out. So this is the remainder of September. We had 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 10, 11, 12, 13. We have 13 no spend days, which is great. Um, I'm hoping to have more no spend days next month. We'll see. Um, so, and then I didn't have any expenses from any of my thinking funds. So that's done for the month. And so let's go to October. And, oh, <laughs> there's a stick of the. All right. Um, so I have that ready. So let me see. 
trying to see which one will be better to be able to show you as I set this up. All right, so I have this. Oh, I gotta wanna show my address, but I have this kit and it is from Paper Loving Mommy. Um, and so I got some stickers from her. So um, I can show you that much. That way it doesn't show my address. But from Paper Loving Mommy, and I'm about to take it out so you all can see it. And I can get the month set up. All right. So inside this monthly kit that I purchased, it was about 10 bucks. Um, well, it was $10 and then shipping was $3.50. So I have an October uh, washi I'm going to lay down up here. I have some scalloped washi I'm going to put at the bottom. Um, and then I have some more washi I'm going to use to set up my sinking funds. And I have some date stickers here I'm going to put down. And then I have some washi here. So, um... Let's go ahead and get this side set up. Oh, I'm about to mess it up. Maybe I should turn it this way and then I can go from there. to mess this up <laughs> oh I still messed it up guys all right I'm back and then I'm laying this down on this side The other one was a bit tricky. All right, so we have that for October. Um, I'm gonna lay some scalloped washi. Which one? I think I'll do the lighter colored one here at the bottom. I think that will be cute. I can get this thing on here. All right. Sorry about that. I got a phone call. I'm filming on my phone. So anyway, I set. I got this set up while I was away. So I have that set up. This looks so beautiful. Wait till you see the one I have for November. All right. So that is set up, and now. I would like to go ahead and get this page set up. I'm trying to see what I had here. So I want to go ahead and get this set up and I'll be right back once I get it set up. All right, I'm back. So we now have um, October set up. I have all the dates here, the scalloped edges. And then on these two pages, I have um, my washi and the edges done um these words came from the planning dancer these are going to be my sinking funds but i wanted the fonts to match and my sinking funds is in a different font um, from that i had that i made myself so i just went ahead and put this up here so that the fonts match um so these will be my sinking funds in the transaction log and we're going to go ahead and get these set up So, for my cash envelopes, I'm going to have the category, and we're going to start here with savings. I think I'll have enough if I skip a line. We'll see. If not, I might have to double up. 
I will be adding some new sinking funds um, for 2021. I just ordered a place to order for new envelopes. So I will be um, diversifying my funds a smidge. I'm really excited because I haven't, um, I've had the same sinking funds for quite some time. So I'm very excited to branch out and try some new ones. Well, add some new ones, I should say. The emergency is here. Um, and car will be car tax because I think I'm going to add um, I will be adding a car maintenance one so that will be getting added so I need one two three four sections here okay that looks good so right after that draw a line oh I didn't go all the way I'll just stop to right there. And then I'll have one for the beginning balance. I have a plus and a minus category. So category beginning plus minus. And then an end. Okay. Oh. There we go. That'll be fine. All right. Beginning plus, minus, and the end. And then, oh. Come out here. And I'll just draw my lines right here. It's not that big of a deal if I have a line right there. Alrighty. So I have that set up. So that's ready to go. And then for my transaction log, I'll just go and start on this line. I wasn't sure if I would have enough for the other side, so I kind of stayed on that top line. And I doubt I'll have this many transactions um, from sinking funds, but you know, you never know. It's always better to be prepared. That's what I say. And you know my motto, the best way to accomplish your goals is to make a plan, so. Amount which doesn't need to be super huge. Then we have the category that I spin it from. And then I'll keep this tight because then the last one will be an explanation. And I have big handwriting and so sometimes I need <clears throat> a few more, I need a little extra space to put to explain what I purchase. All right, so we have that. And I will go ahead on and get this set up. All right, so I number my transactions. So I usually will have the number, the date, amount, category and explanation for my transaction log. And then on this side, I have my category beginning, plus if I add money, minus when I take money out of sinking funds, and then the ending balance at the end of the month. So I have it all set up, it looks so good. I'm very excited about um, setting this up. This is my first time um, 
setting this up like this with all the beautiful washi. Well, my first time on camera. Um, I have some stuff, let me see. Back in June, I had some things here that I used uh, from Mama Sila Budgets. I had purchased a weekly check-in kit and done that. So I have done that before, but this is my first time doing like the full set up on camera so i'm very excited about it that set up let's go through my expenses for this one so i like to change it up i don't want to keep the same colors every month um so i think for this month I'll do this baby pink color. I think I'll do this darker pink for one. I'm coming, just trying to figure out. So I have one, two, and I need a third one. So I guess I'll do, let's see. I'll go ahead and still do blue for one. All right, so I think I'll do my debit will be this baby pink. I think I'll do cash, this color, and credit, this color for the month. So those will be the three colors I use. I just like to change it up. I like to have some variety. Variety is the spice of life. So I'll change them up and do these. So for my first expense, We will have a debit. So I'll pull out the light pink. And for the light pink, um, my first expense will be on the first. I only have one, so I don't have to be. So my expense here was um, money to Miss T. It's a friend that I have in Florida, where I'm originally from, and she gets items for me from Joanne. Uh, we The Joanne stores in my part of Louisiana don't have, they don't carry uh, stickers and um, other planner supplies. They only carry fabric and other things like sewing needs. So I'm very lucky that she gets things for me. Then, oh, that was a tail, I have more stuff. So then let's see. I need one of these. And another light pink. All right, so I do need more space. So here, I think I've told you before, I have a friend who has who's trying to get her book funded. <clears throat> she has a Kickstarter, and I sent her $30, and that was debit. And then my last charge, I will have to try squeeze it in. It's going to go a little bit 
on the other day from the week, but I will just try to line it up here. Let's see, oh, I'm making a mess, no surprise. All right, that's good enough. And then I had a capital one. So some of these charges I make sometimes are on credit and then I just go ahead um, <clears throat> and then I just pay it right back off. But I like to get try to get the points. So I have a capital one charge there. Um, and then on the second, I got my toiletries and I spend $50 a month and I spent $50.50, which was amazing. And I got these from Amazon and that was a debit charge. And then Saturday, I did not spend any money. So I will start with the my first no spend day. And of course these stickers are from Mama Sila Budgets. So I have those. And I kinda wanna move it a little bit, but that's all right. I'll just leave it there so I don't pull it up. Um, so that is my, I will zoom you out here. That is my first part of October setting it up. I did not spend anything from my stinking funds or for my trans and I had any transaction in the transaction log. So nothing here. I will go ahead on and fill this in. Let me pull out my micro happy notes. That's how I track. So my beginning balance is $181 for savings. Clothing I have. $80 medical I have 151 gifts I have nothing miscellaneous I have 120 car tags I have a dollar I'll start funding car tags next paycheck Christmas, I have 221, emergency, I have 180, and then I have nothing in either one of these yet, because I'm not ready to start funding these yet, so everything is filled in now, awesome. So, thank you for watching my video today, watching my weekly check-in. They're not usually this long, but I did want to get um, my setup for October done. So, I appreciate you watching my video. If you want to see my um, budget for October, my first budget video for October is up. So, check that out on my channel. Um, and have a wonderful day. And remember, the best way to accomplish your goals is to make a plan. Bye.